Ever wondered what books every gentleman should read? Welcome to a literary journey where we uncover the five essential books that should grace the bookshelves of all gentlemen. Reading isn't just a hobby, it's a gateway to expanding our minds and understanding the world from different perspectives. It's a tool for personal growth, a means to acquire knowledge, and a way to develop empathy and compassion. In this video we will be delving into the heart of literature, from timeless classics to thought-provoking narratives, each book hand-picked for its potential to shape and inspire the modern gentleman. These books aren't just stories, they're lessons about life, society and our roles within it. They are reflections of humanity, mirrors that allow us to see ourselves and the world in a different light. So, are you ready to embark on this literary adventure? Stay tuned to discover the top 5 books every gentleman should have on their bookshelf. Kicking off our list is the timeless classic To Kill a Mockingbird by Harper Lee. This Pulitzer Prize-winning novel, set in the deep south of the United States during the Great Depression, is woven with themes of morality, justice, and the loss of innocence, making it a profound read that leaves a lasting impression. At the heart of the story is the character of Atticus Finch, a man of integrity and moral courage. As a lawyer, he takes on a case that puts him and his family in the crosshairs of prejudice and hatred. Yet, his unwavering belief in justice, his steadfastness in the face of adversity, and his commitment to truth, even when it's unpopular, make Atticus a model of moral strength. His character teaches us about the importance of standing up for what's right, even if we stand alone. But, To Kill a Mockingbird is not just about the fight for justice, it's also about understanding and empathy. Through the innocent eyes of Scout, Atticus's young daughter, we are reminded of the importance of stepping into another's shoes to see their perspective. This understanding breeds compassion and tolerance, values that are essential for any gentleman navigating today's diverse world. One of the book's most powerful lessons is about the loss of innocence. As Scout and her brother Jem confront the harsh realities of their society, they must reconcile their idealistic views of the world with its often unpleasant truths. This poignant theme serves as a reminder that wisdom often comes with the cost of innocence. In essence, To Kill a Mockingbird is a mirror held up to society reflecting its virtues and vices, its struggles and triumphs. It's a book that challenges us to question our own views, to stand up against injustice, and to empathize with others. This book is a must-read for every gentleman seeking to understand and navigate the complexities of morality and justice in society. Next on our list is the dazzling and tragic tale of The Great Gatsby by F. Scott Fitzgerald. Dive into the Roaring Twenties, a time of speakeasies, jazz, and wild parties, with Fitzgerald's magnum opus, The Great Gatsby. This novel centers around the elusive and enigmatic millionaire Jay Gatsby, who throws lavish parties in the hopes of rekindling a lost love. The Great Gatsby is a rich exploration of themes that are as relevant today as they were in the Jazz Age. One of the most prominent themes is the idea of the American dream, the belief that anyone, regardless of their background, can achieve success through hard work and determination. Jay Gatsby embodies this dream, rising from a humble background to amass a fortune. However, Fitzgerald doesn't present this as a triumphant story, Instead, he paints a picture of disillusionment, showing us that the pursuit of wealth and status can lead to a hollow, unfulfilling existence. Jay Gatsby's character is a study in ambition and persistence. His relentless pursuit of Daisy, the woman he loves but lost to another man, speaks volumes about his character. He is willing to do anything, even compromise his morals, to achieve his dream. But his dream is an illusion, just like the green light at the end of Daisy's dock that he reaches out to, but can never touch. This brings us to another crucial theme, the critique of materialism. Gatsby's extravagant lifestyle, his opulent mansion and his extravagant parties are all a facade. Beneath the glitz and glamour, Gatsby is a lonely man, yearning for something money can't buy, genuine love and companionship. Fitzgerald uses Gatsby's story to criticize the materialistic society of the 1920s, a critique that still hits home in the 21st century. The Great Gatsby is a timeless classic that offers a cautionary tale about the dangers of unchecked ambition and the hollow pursuit of wealth. It's a book that every gentleman should read to understand the emptiness that can come from chasing the wrong dreams. It reminds us that while wealth and success can be part of the dream, they should never be the dream itself. Coming up third on our list is Meditations by Marcus Aurelius. This timeless classic is not just a book but a treasure trove of wisdom a conversation with a wise friend, and a mirror to one's soul. Penned by a Roman emperor it offers a profound exploration of Stoic philosophy, 
a philosophy that emphasizes the importance of self-control, integrity, and personal growth. Meditations is unique in its essence, as it was never intended for public viewing. Instead, it was Marcus Aurelius's personal diary, where he noted down his thoughts and reflections. This aspect makes meditations an incredibly intimate and powerful read, allowing us a glimpse into the mind of one of the most powerful men of his time. Marcus Aurelius was a Stoic, and his writings are a testament to his deep understanding of Stoicism. The book explores the philosophy's core tenets, laying emphasis on the importance of accepting things as they are, not as we want them to be. It teaches us to focus on what's within our control, and let go of the rest. The book is filled with practical wisdom that transcends time and culture. Marcus Aurelius reminds us to be mindful of the present moment, to act with integrity, and to treat others with kindness. He explores the fleeting nature of life, the inevitability of change, and the importance of maintaining equanimity in the face of both prosperity and adversity. The beauty of meditations lies in its simplicity and relevance. Whether you're a CEO running a multinational corporation or a student just starting out in life, the lessons in this book can guide you towards a life of virtue and wisdom. In essence, meditations provides timeless insights into human nature and the condition of life itself. It encourages us to live a life of purpose, integrity and tranquility, irrespective of external circumstances. A true gentleman after all is one who shows grace under pressure, and meditations offers the tools to do just that. This book is an invaluable guide for any gentleman seeking to lead a life of virtue and wisdom. Fourth on our list is The Dystopian Masterpiece, 1984, by George Orwell. This classic novel paints a chilling portrait of a future under the thumb of an all-seeing, all-knowing totalitarian regime. The protagonist, Winston Smith, lives in a world where privacy is a myth, truth is a malleable concept, and freedom, a distant memory. Orwell's 1984 presents a stark exploration of totalitarianism, a political system where the state holds total authority over society and seeks to control all aspects of public and private life. The book's depiction of a society under constant surveillance, where even thoughts are monitored, underlines the dangers of such an absolute authority. The novel also delves into the theme of individual freedom, or rather, its absence. Winston's struggle to maintain his individuality and sanity in the face of the party's relentless psychological manipulation underscores the preciousness of personal freedom. But perhaps what makes 1984 most impactful is its warning about unchecked government power. Orwell imagines a world where the state has complete control over information and history, altering facts to suit its narrative, eroding the very essence of truth. This alarming vision serves as a reminder of the consequences of allowing power to go unchecked. 1984 is more than just a novel. It's a cautionary tale about the erosion of individual rights and the perils of absolute power. This book is a sobering reminder of the importance of freedom and the perils of unchecked power. Rounding off our list is the ancient military treatise The Art of War by Sun Tzu. Written more than 2,000 years ago, this book has withstood the test of time and remains a vital read for men across the globe. At its core, The Art of War is a compilation of timeless principles of strategy, tactics, and warfare. Sun Tzu's wisdom transcends the battlefield, offering readers a deep understanding of the dynamics of conflict and the intricate dance of power. However, do not be mistaken, this book isn't just about war, its principles are applicable in various spheres of life. In business, it can guide you to outwit competition and navigate turbulent market conditions. In politics, it can help you understand the nuances of negotiation and the power of alliances. Even in personal life, the art of war has much to offer. Whether it's managing conflicts, making strategic decisions, or simply understanding the psychology of human behavior, Sun Tzu's teachings provide invaluable insights. One of Sun Tzu's most quoted lines, the supreme art of war is to subdue the enemy without fighting, is a testament to the book's emphasis on strategy over brute force. It teaches that the greatest victories are those achieved without unnecessary conflict. In essence, the art of war is not just a book about warfare, but a profound guide to understanding and navigating the complexities of life. This book is a must-read for any gentleman seeking to understand and master the art of strategy. And there you have it five books that every gentleman should read. We've journeyed through the heart of the American South with Harper Lee's To Kill a Mockingbird, exploring themes of morality and justice. 
We've lived the decadence and disillusionment of the Roaring Twenties in F. Scott Fitzgerald's The Great Gatsby. We've delved into the introspective wisdom of Marcus Aurelius in Meditations, and witnessed the dystopian future envisaged by George Orwell in 1984. And finally, we've studied the strategic brilliance of Sun Tzu's The Art of War. Each of these books offers invaluable insights into different facets of life, society, and the human condition. I encourage you to read these works not just for the joy of reading but for the growth they can inspire. In each page you'll find a chance to expand your understanding, to challenge your assumptions, and to develop a more nuanced view of the world. Remember a well-read gentleman is a well-rounded gentleman. Happy reading! Mm -hmm.